Hey guys, what's up? It's Nick here, and in this video I'm going to be answering a question that I got on my video about how to code your own website from scratch, which is how do I post it on the web so that other people can see it. This is a comment that I got on how to code your own website from scratch part 2. And so in this video I'm going to answer how to post your website on the web for absolutely free. Now I want to apologize if this video isn't really edited as well. Uh, I'm kind of strapped for time so I don't have the time to go ahead and edit this video. So it's going to be a really quick video and um, if you guys are wondering how I'm zooming in, by the way, I'm just holding down control and using the scroll wheel on my mouse. So anyway, uh, let's go ahead and answer the question, how do I post it on the web so that other people can see it? So anyway, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to first have your website made. So here I have my website right here, which is the Apple PC 98 website. And what you can go ahead and do is just make sure you have the website customized it every way you want to with your pages right here and your images folder. And then what you want to do is you want to go ahead and get some free web hosting. Now there are a lot of web websites out there for free web hosting but the one that I suggest or the one that I use is a website called 00webhost.com which I'll post the link to in the video's description. So once you have that just go ahead and make an account with them. Just scroll down here under free web hosting and then go ahead and click on the order now right there under the free web hosting tab right there. Just go down and click on order now and then you can sign up for a free web hosting account. So if I do that I click order now and then you go ahead you host your own domain with your domain right here which is uh, you can go ahead and register with the domain that you've already registered or you can choose your own subdomain. So anyway just go ahead and make a free web hosting account right there and then go ahead and log into your members cPanel. Now to do this you're going to need an FTP client. For this I'm going to be using the FTP client FileZilla down here which is absolutely free. To download that you just go ahead and uh, just go ahead and search for FileZilla which you can go ahead and download from here which is FileZilla-project.org you can download for all platforms or the one for Windows only so this will work on Mac, Linux and Windows so once you have FileZilla downloaded what you want to do is you want to go to your uh, 00 web host C panel or your free web hosting C panel what you want to do is you want to go ahead and scroll down until you see this right here that says view FTP details Go ahead and click on that, and it should bring you up with this. That'll have your FTP host name, your FTP username, FTP password, and all the rest of this stuff. So once you have that done, you want to go down and you want to launch up FileZilla. So once FileZilla launches up, it'll come to this. So what you want to do is you want to go up here to File and Site Manager. And then it'll come up to this, and what you want to do is you want to go down here and click on New Site, and then you can uh, go ahead and put this. So you put in your FTP host right here, so that'll be the uh, FTP host name right there. Uh, so you go ahead and put your FTP host in. You go ahead and put in your port. Most ports would be 21, but the port's uh, not that necessary. Here on the server type, you want to put FTP for File Transfer Protocol. Just keep it at FTP. When it has logon type, you can click ask for password and then go ahead and put your user, which will be your FTP username. Once you have that done, you want to go ahead and click on connect and then go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and put in my password. So, so I put in my password and it starts connecting and it should come up to a folder like this. Now it, it varies on what kind of web hosting plan you're on. So since I'm on 00 web host, it looks a little something like this with the file here that says do not upload and then another uh, hosting file. Now this file here that says do not upload files here, it says do not upload files here. It means don't upload files here. So where you do upload files is you upload the files into the public folder right here. And as you see here, here's my pages right here. My index page, my contact page, my images page, and uh, my WordPress blog folder. So what you do is once you have, uh, you go into that public folder here and then there should be nothing in there but a sample PHP page. So uh, you go into that public folder and what you do is you select everything from your website folder and drag that in here after deleting the sample PHP page or whatever comes in there. Just make this folder empty and then go ahead and drag in uh, your website files. Like all these files right here, I click and drag in. Then I'd wait for it to upload. And then once that's done, we can go ahead and close out a FileZilla. And then you go ahead to your address. So mine would be would be a1102105.net46.net. It would go ahead to the website the way I made it, which for some reason doesn't have a background. So um, it'll go to the website the way you made it. And then uh, if you guys want a free domain, I suggest something like co.cc which you can go ahead and uh, register free domains from here. 
uh, it's kind of slow today. So you can go ahead and register free domains here from co.cc. Uh, it's taking a little while. You can also register free domains from co.tv, which is what I have my domain under. So um, you can go ahead and register domains from here. You can also register domains from co.nr, which is free domain.co.nr. And you can also register domains from dot dot tk. Oh, I put tl, sorry. Dot dot tk. So um, let's go ahead and, well, yeah, you basically get the idea. So, um, and then uh, I went ahead and I registered my domain with co.tv. And so my website is applepc98.co.tv which comes up to this, which does have the background loaded. So uh, yeah, so you can just go ahead and do that. So uh, let me go ahead and go over the things for you again. Oops, sorry. Uh, you want to go ahead and have some free web hosting. So sign up for free web hosting, which I suggest here as your web host. Then go and view your FTP details and put them into FileZilla. And then after that, you can go ahead and get your free domain from here. And then your internet website that you made for free is on the web for free. So sorry for the laid back video that's not edited and not really planned out. I hope this answers your question. Uh, how do you post your website on the web so other people can see it? So anyway, I uh, hope that answers your question. All these links will be in the description, so don't worry. So anyway, thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.